Welcome to the Friday special how-to tips and tricks. Hey, Eric here with Adventures in Wet Shaving. If this is your first time here and you're interested in straight razor shaving, go ahead and click on that subscribe button so you don't miss a thing. All right. Now, this is the Friday special and tonight we are doing the second pass in this shave. I'm going to be using my Gold Dollar 66. All right, hollow ground. This is something we honed up uh, a while back. All right. Now I'm also using Stash Soap Works, and this is E Barber. This is just a wonderful barbershop scent. Really, really good stuff and performs well. Now, in the description, I will go ahead and have all of the ingredients and the scent profile there for you as well. Plus, I will have links to everything I used in this shave, including my 30 degree strop. All right, so now, my uh, I've, I've taken a little time in between here to uh, do some setup. So I'm going to go ahead and get my face wet again. And now I am using my Omega 10,098. It is loaded. It's past two. And let's get going on this. All right. Now, in between passes, your soap can dry out. And, you know, there's not a problem. You just rehydrate that soap. And if you don't have enough soap, go back to the puck and just get more. No big deal. All right. Now, here's the thing. We're in pass two, so we need to decide what we want to do. There's two schools of thought. You either do an across the grain pass for your second pass or you do an against the grain pass for your second pass. Now, that's going to be totally up to you. I'm going to suggest you try both. And, you know, at one point, try to do a across the grain. See how it goes for you. Then later on, try to go against the grain. See how it goes for you. Okay. And you know, by this time, since we're in the second pass, guys, you have been straight razor shaping for a while. And you should be uh, more proficient. You should actually know how your beard grows and know which direction the hair grows. So you really will know how to do the uh, direction of your beard. Okay, for example, uh, you would know how your beard grows, so you would then have to try to figure out how to get the right angle on that razor to get to that, all right? All right, so now for me, this is the second pass. So that for me is going to actually be an across the grain and against the grain pass. All right, I'm going to go across the grain on my neck here, and I'm going to go against the grain on my neck on my cheeks. And then here, this is going to be across the grain. Here is going to be against the grain like this. Through this section, that is going to be against the grain directly, all right? So now I start with my, my dominant hand, and we're gonna start on this side. All right, so see, I'm holding the razor a little differently than I've been holding it. And I am going to uh, 
Try to keep that spine either very close to the skin or uh, just a, a spine width off of my neck. And I'm stretching with my, this other hand as well. Okay, and then I got that extra soap. We'll just get that off of there. All right, now in this section, this really is going to be against the grain for me. This was pretty much across the grain. Now you see what I'm doing there? I'm smiling and I'm holding down at the same time. That's the best way to get my skin taut. You don't want to over tighten but you have to stretch. All right, now at this point, like I said earlier, you have been shaving for a while with a straight razor. So if you feel comfortable, you just keep going, all right? If you don't, switch back to the DE or the cartridge, whatever, and go from there. Now again, for me, that stroke was pretty much against the grain. As well as this one. All right, so there we go. Now see, I'm getting that blade wet, but I'm not getting the handle or the pivot point wet. All right, very important. Now we're switching hands, and I'm gonna get this side now. Now, as you notice, I'm, I'm going straight across my neck, and then we're gonna work on our cheeks. Now the real trick here is learning how your beard grows and then finding the right angle to hold that blade. Now I'm switching up that handle a little bit. Now on my cheek, all of that is against the grain. That was against the grain. Now down here on my chin, this is gonna be kind of against the grain, kind of uh, across the grain, all right?
All right, nice. Okay, now this soap is drying out because we're talking a lot. All right, if you were just shaving and going right to town with this, it wouldn't be such a big deal. But I'm going to go ahead and just refresh because there aren't any rules. See, we go like that. Good to go. Get those hands nice and dry. All right. And now for this side, I'm switching hands again. I'm going back to my dominant hand. Okay. All right, now that was totally against the grain. Now this is going to be against the grain. Now on my chin, this is kind of against and across. All right, nice. And I've got just a little soap on there. So what we're going to do now is work on that mustache area. And you see, that's pretty much the same thing I did the first time. It's okay because it's going to get a little bit more every time. All right, now, again, I did exactly the same thing I did before, and it's going to just get a little bit more every time, guys. Now, here, what I'm going to do is switch it up a little bit just to get around this area. Now again, that was pretty much primarily with the grain. Now over here on this side, I'm going to just go straight up with the grain. All right, there you go. Pass two complete. Let's go ahead and see how we did. Oh yeah, I'm telling you, every time that works for me on those cheeks, really does, does a really good job. All right, so coming up next is gonna be pass three and I hope to see you there. All right. Now, listen, guys, if you can give me ideas for Friday special videos, uh, 
or you have a question that I can video and put on YouTube, I will give you a shout out and in the uh, description I will put a link to your channel if you have videos uploaded. Thank you guys so much for watching all the way to the end. Really appreciate you and all you do for me. Click right over here to see past three of this shave. Click down here on a video specially picked out for you. Click over here on me. Subscribe, like, comment. Share this video with your friends. Have a great shave and a good day. And I will see you next time on Adventures in Wet Shaving.